It was the morning of 26 December 2004. There was a massive earthquake off the coast of Sumatra with a staggering magnitude of 9.3. The resulting tsunami killed 230,000 people. This left a million others homeless, hopeless, and indeed, wishing they were dead. The plight of the many affected people and countries prompted a worldwide humanitarian response. Many organizations, including and especially the Buddhist Library, a non-profit organization, volunteered in helping families build new homes and ultimately build new lives. Okay, many organizations helped. What did the Buddhist Library do so special to separate them from the others? First up, there was a bicycle project. Volunteers would assemble bicycles all by themselves, providing victims a source of transport for free. How cool is that? And that wasn't enough. There was also the wheelchair project, where they would distribute free wheelchairs to the disabled. Do you want to help? You can. There are five simple ways. You can share. Share this video with your friends, with your family. Secondly, money. Money is a big term. If one were to donate $5, 25 people will have $125. Two thousand family people will have $12,500. 250,000 people will have a million two hundred fifty thousand dollars A small amount will go a long way. Get yourself involved. Involved in all these events. Help the poor. Learn about the unfortunate. Experience what these people are going through. Please help them. And if you haven't figured it out, put them all together. You get small. And at the end of the day, that's all we want for these people. To make them small. And you know, that's not all the Buddhist Library does. It organizes social events like these. You know, boosting the camaraderie between the youth. The adults, having events, dinners, to foster the bonds between the young, the middle aged, and the old. Personally, I'm not Buddhist, and really, I'm not part of the Buddhist library, and I'm not getting paid to say this, but we all are human, and we need to help out each and every one of us when in need, because indeed, when we bleed, we bleed all the same.